Hello and welcome to my video where I will show you how to install and configure my plugin <coughs> Walmart Automatic Automatic Post Generator from Walmart. To get started with this plugin, click Plugins Add New, Upload Plugin, choose File, navigate to the zip file you downloaded, and click Install Now. After the installation process, activate the plugin, go to Plugin Settings. Here you must insert your API key. Walmart Epic key. If you don't insert the Walmart Epic key, the plugin will, will not work. Also, you can insert your affiliate ID. This is optional. If you leave the affiliate ID blank, you your the plugin will work, but uh, sales won't generate you affiliate income. The sales that your blog generates won't generate you affiliate income. Okay. To get the Walmart Epic key, click here. Fill in the required fields, username, display name, email, and click register. After you have registered, you will get an affiliate, uh, an Epic key. Insert the Epic key here, save settings. Uh, also, <coughs> to get an affiliate ID, Click here, fill in the required uh, form and click sign me up now. After you sign up, you will get an affiliate ID. Fill in the uh, affiliate ID here and click save info. If both fields are filled in, the plugin will generate posts and you will get paid for the sales that your blog generates. Okay, now I will pause the video and include my epic key. I'll pause the video because I don't want to show you my epic key because it is confidential. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I filled in the epic key. Now let's go to generate some posts. Here are keywords to post menu. Here I can generate posts from keywords. Let's say I want to search for iPod. Save settings. Schedule. Uh, this defines the rule, how uh, the interval in which the rule will automatically run. Uh, this is defined in hours, so this rule will run every 24 hours. At uh, running, 10 posts will be generated at, mo at maximum. The post will be published. You can also moderate by pending or draft. Item type should be post. Here you, you will see every custom page type you have in WordPress. Post author admin. And advanced options. You have, you can define the, it, the post title. Here you can have short codes in your, here in the title. These shortcodes will be replaced for each item for specific content for each item. So if you enter this shortcode item title, this will be replaced with the title of the uh, product from Walmart. Also you have other shortcodes to play with. Same thing for post content. Here we have more shortcodes. We have also price, UPC, uh, stock, and many, many others. Item content, a link to add to cart with your affiliate ID added, and item media. These are pictures from the item. Searching category. Here we have all Walmart categories listed. We leave this at any. Sort results by relevance order descendant skip first results if you want to skip let's say first 10 results from the post include here 10 strip images from content limit title word count generate post format if your team supports custom post formats you can select one here additional post category you can add categories auto add categories from title from item or from both auto add tags same insert additional text for posts comment enable comments pingbacks trackbacks auto get featured image 
this will automatically generate featured image for your post and insert here a path to an image if no image is found for the post this default image will be set for the post as featured image and import comments you can import item reviews as comments so let's say i import five item reviews as comments okay now let's visit our blog and it is blank right now and let's run this rule. Rule running shouldn't take pretty much. It is running right now. And it generated posts. Let's refresh our blog. And here are the results for iPod search. Let's have a look at the post, random one, this one, let's say. This is the post description the link to add to cart with our affiliate id added if we have one and some pictures also we see the reviews as comments okay now let's head back delete these posts delete the rule and continue here you can search for an item id or upc include your item id or upc and uh, the post will be generated uh, note that here you can include more item ids separated by commas recommended items you can generate posts okay you can generate posts uh, from recommended item uh, based on an item ID so uh, to understand this let's see an item on Walmart let's say this laptop uh, okay I don't know what I just did let's go back to let's say this laptop maybe I go okay right now yeah so let's see this laptop and if we scroll down we see recommended items for uh, so customers also considered this so if you use this uh, recommended item to post these will be posted S so if you insert the id for this laptop you will get these results for the recommended items let's go to the trending maximum number of posts let's say i want five posts from the trending save the rule and run this rule now <coughs> and back to our blog let's see what's trending on Walmart right now air fryer hmm, interesting okay we have also some feeds pre-order products bestseller products and special buy products let's import bestseller products five bestseller products also note that our affiliate IDs are added to all these posts let's go to the blog and let's see what we have we have some notebooks these don't have pictures okay and uh, last thing is activity and logging section here we have the list of rules that are currently running restore default settings delete all generate with post by this plugin and activity log okay now let's get back to the main settings and see there are some additional features i'll pause the video to delete the api key be right back in a minute okay i'm back i deleted the key we have some plugin options do not check for duplicate posts 
if we check this the plugin will not check for duplicate not check for duplicate content and uh, we'll post duplicate posts uh, strip links from generated post content you can strip links from cover post content show extended item information uh, if you check this if you go to posts in, in WordPress and select a generated post you will see this meta box with additional item information. Here you can disable this feature. You can enable logging. This is default. You can enable detailed logging to see each action the plugin will take. You can automatically create logs. Uh, you can set a timeout for rule running. If a rule runs more than this amount of seconds, it will automatically be stopped. You can uh, uh, send a rule running summary in email to this email address minimum title worker, maximum title worker, minimum content worker, maximum content worker, band word is required worries these are restrictions for posting if the post does not meet these restrictions it will not be published featured image uh, resize size you can define the size of the featured image this will save you hosting space strip HTML uh, elements by ID or class Skip posts that do not have images. Automatically translate content using Google Translate to any language. High Google Translate pop-up. Uh, spin text using built-in method or free other mm, methods. Also, we have a random sentence generator. Define here sentences with variables. The uh, plugin will choose a random one sentence from here and will uh, fill in the variable with its value that you define here. So if you define a variable eject, adjective very or adjective, you have clever, interesting, smart, huge, astonishing. Okay. Also, we have some custom HTML shortcodes to define in the uh, post content. You can insert here ads, ad codes, or anything you want. And also we have a affiliate keyword replacer settings. Search for a keyword in the post content, replace it with another, another keyword and add a link to it. So this is all. I hope you will enjoy this plugin. Have a nice day. Bye bye.